Hello guys and welcome back to the Minecraft Multi Force. Today I'm here with Zytrix and he's the designer behind the U2 spy plane. So this aircraft is nicknamed the Dragon Lady and it was manufactured by Lockheed Martin and starting in the 1950s this is when it was introduced and is used by the United States Air Force who still uses it to this day as well as the CIA who stopped using it but they did use this during the Cold War. And uh, here's what it looks like. There's several configurations of this. They can customize it. The latest version of the U2 is the U2S, which is what this is actually based on. So if you look on the spine, there's actually like this satellite uh, comm system. It's known as the Senior Span, or there's another one called the Senior Spur. It like changes depending on the configuration. And also on uh, the wings, there's actually these things. They're called Super Pods. And I actually thought they were drop tanks at first, but they're actually used for carrying um, surveillance equipment inside. So these are not carrying any fuel. And um, also uh, several other variants of the U2. They have like a uh, configured like elongated nose, but I believe this one is the normal one. Um, but anyways, that's pretty much it for the build. And let's get started on the tutorial. All right, to get started, we're going to take out black concrete. We're going to place that three blocks above the ground. So one, two, three, delete these blocks. And we're going to make this so it's 26 blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. And then we're going to place a redstone lamp at the tip with a dark oak button right there. All right, now we'd go back to the front and we need to add a dragon head. So it's actually gonna face towards the tip. So we're gonna place a block temporarily here, place a dragon head. And then we're gonna delete this block right there. So it's a little curve like that. And then on top, we're gonna add a dark oak button here. And then two dark oak trap doors. Then dark oak slab, then two dark oak planks. Then a daylight detector here, we're going to make it blue. And then we're going to add in two nether brick slabs. Then two uh, daylight detectors, make them blue. And I am crouching in midair just to place them. And let's add a dark oak trapdoor right there. So we're going to go to the back again, add black concrete right above that lamp, and extend it all the way towards the front. like so. All right, then we're gonna add a lever. I'm gonna face towards the back. I'm gonna close that trap door. And then we're gonna add in five of these nether brick walls. So one, two, three, four, five. And on top of the last wall, we're gonna add a nether brick stairs, face the back, nether brick slab behind it. And then the front of it, we're gonna add four black concrete blocks, so one, two, three, four, another brick stairs in the front, and on top we're going to add two dark oak um, trap doors like that, and then two black carpets right there. All right, so then in the back section we're going to add another brick stairs uh, right behind this upper row of black concrete. And then down below let's add in um, dark oak trap door right underneath that button and also we're going to add that to the side. Now we're only going to build half the aircraft so I guess we're just going to be building this part. So add a dark oak trap door here, close it up and you want to make sure it's facing actually the right direction so maybe I'll have to place a block temporarily there and then I'll place a dark oak button back like that. All right, then on top, we're going to add black concrete, four blocks tall on top of the stairs. So one, two, three, four. Add one front and then another brick wall in the front of that. Then we're going to add black concrete all the way down. So it reaches down to the fuselage. And let's add one in the front corner and then another brick slab here. And then a dark oak trap door in front of that. Now the inside part, there is this red terracotta block. So we're gonna add one here. And on top, we're gonna add two. Then we're gonna add a daylight detector here, make it blue. 
and another brick slab behind it. Now in the front, there's going to be a black carpet, or not a black carpet, a black banner, I mean, cover up that red in the front. And I guess you, if you want to, you can cover up the back, but I guess we didn't do that. And now we're going to add these black concretes inside the tail, like so. And then we'll add another brick wall right behind this black concrete. All right, then we're gonna go back over here, right to where this uh, dark oak trap door is. Go go down. Gonna add a landing gear, which is just a stone brick wall like that. And the wheel is gonna be made of coal. So it's a coal block like that. All right, and then on this side, let's add a stone button here. All right, then we're gonna go to the front. Let's add a dark oak uh, trap door right underneath that first black concrete. And nether brick slabs until it goes just like two blocks away from that uh, landing gear. So there's going to be a gap of space right there. And then behind the landing gear, we're going to add another brick slab. And we're going to make it go all the way to the back. So extend that all the way back. And then we'll need to add another landing gear here. So that's going to line up with this slab up there. So delete this block and add in this nether brick wall. And there is a grindstone underneath, so let's add that, like so. All right, then we're going to go to the front. Let's add a dark oak fence gate right here. Line it up with that trap door, open it up, and let's add two um, nether brick walls right behind it. Then we're going to go diagonally up and add another dark oak fence gate here, open it up. Then add three dark oak, or not dark oak, nether brick walls, I mean, like that. Then we're going to take out another brick stairs and we're going to line that up all the way across to this back wall right here. So extend that out. Should line up with the last wall like that. Then we're going to go to the back and on the side of this lamp we're going to add in two another brick walls. Then black concrete in the front of it and extend that all the way across till it meets the other side. Okay, and then we're going to go back over here to the back, and we're going to add in two um, dark oak trap doors here. And then another brick slabs all the way to that stairs that we just placed earlier. Alright, cool, and then we'll work on the tail a little bit. So we're going to take a acacia button, add it right above that red uh, terracotta, and then two dark oak buttons on the top strip right here, and these are going to be the little crosses. And then there's going to be an acacia sign dangling down towards the front, like that in front of that red terracotta. All right, then we're going to go to the front and go right underneath this um, another brick wall. Let's add acacia button. And then up over here, we're going to add in two daylight detectors, like that. We're going to keep it yellow. And let's add another brick slab right in front of this nether brick stairs. And then we're gonna go across all of the stairs with the slabs. And then we're gonna go to the back here over here. Let's add in two dark oak um, trap doors like that. And we're gonna go dangling down. Let's add in two uh, nether brick walls like so. Then we're gonna go to the front where the acacia button is. Go dangling down towards the back. Let's add in three dark oak trap doors like that. And we'll add another dark oak trap door sticking out right here in the middle. And we're going to add another dark oak trap door. It's going to face uh, towards the inside. And we want to open it up so it's like a little wall like that. All right, then we're going to go to the back. Let's go right to the side of this nether brick walls. And we're going to add in two dark oak uh, trap doors like that. Then we're going to add in another brick uh, slab. Extend that all the way towards the front like so, and then we're gonna take black concrete, add it right after this trap door, extend it all the way to the back, like so. Then we're gonna add in two dark oak trap doors underneath the black concrete, and then we'll take out uh, nether brick slabs, add it right here, extend that all the way towards the front. All right, then we're gonna take out dark oak signs, we're gonna add two of them on the side, and let's add a dark oak button right there. 
Then we're going to go up over here. We're going to add two dark oak signs to the side of that black concrete. Then we'll move to the back. Let's work on the tail a little bit. So we're going to take out another brick uh, slab. Add it right underneath that acacia sign. Two blocks along like that. And let's make it a two by three. And then we'll add in uh, three nether brick slabs in the middle. And then one in the back. And then we'll add in two dark oak trap doors in the front. And then one in the back, like so. Then we're going to go to the back landing gear where this nether brick wall is. We're going to cover that up with a dark oak sign like that. All right, next we're going to make the wings. So let's go right after this uh, dark oak button. Like a skip block. And we're going to add in five dark oak trap doors. Like so. All right. Then on the back of that, we're going to add uh, four blocks long of nether brick slabs. And we're going to make it five blocks wide like this. So it's like a giant rectangle. And the back of that, we're going to add in five more dark oak uh, trap doors. So it looks like this. Then we're going to add black concrete to the edge of the wing. So extend that out. And then it's going to go one block past the back and three blocks in the front. So one, two, three, like that. Then we're going to add a dark oak button in the front. And then on the side, we're going to add in two dark oak signs like that, as well as the other side of it. Then on top, we're going to skip block here and add a dark oak trap door. Then we're going to add two daylight detectors to make them blue. And then we'll add in uh, to the back another brick wall here, dark oak trap door, and then two daylight detectors to make them blue. And then we'll add in uh, another brick slabs inside like that. So then we're going to go underneath. We're going to add a dark oak trap door right around here towards the last detector and then we'll go to the back skip a block add another trap door and the space in between would fill that in with nether brick slabs like so all right then we're going to add dark oak trap door line it up with the other trap doors so just one in the front and one in the back and then in the space in between we're going to add nether brick slabs and we're going to make this segment seven blocks long so one two three, four, five, six, seven, and then extend the rest out all the way across like so. Then we're going to add dark oak trap doors in the front and the back, the wing like that. And then inside we're going to replace these two slabs and we're going to place nether brick walls back to back or nether brick stairs, I mean, back to back like that. And then we'll add in um, this nether brick slab towards the back. And another nether brick slabs go down, like, down towards the back. And then underneath this slab, we're going to add a dark oak fence gate face towards the back. And let's add a grindstone so it connects like that, so it does float a little bit like that. So then we're going to take another brick slab. We're going to add seven blocks here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then extend the other side, seven as well. And then it's going to go one block past it. So it's like eight right there. And let's add a uh, dark oak trap door in the front of that like so. So next we're going to take black carpet. And let's cover up this middle area right here. Go all the way across. Right over there to that super pod. And the other side. And then towards the front, you can fill all this in. Uh, black carpet as well as this area and the spaces that do not have black carpet on them are this chop door and then this row chop door so just completely ignore that area just fill in the other areas unless you want to make it like super black or something uh, but this is how it was made so it should look like this all right then one last thing we're to go back to this front landing gear and we need to replace these two slabs with two nether brick stairs upside down facing towards the wheel and yeah that's pretty much it for the build and now we're going to flip it off to the other side 
All right, so once you finish off the other side, it should look like this, and this is the final product. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the build. And thanks to Zytrex for the original design. Give him credit if you're actually building this. And if you guys liked this video, remember to hit that like button down below and subscribe if you hadn't already because I'll be uploading more videos like this in the future. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.